Mastering English Grammar – The Power of the SVOC Pattern Hello, English learners. Welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we'll be delving into the exciting world of sentence structure, specifically focusing on the subject-verb-object complement (SVOC) pattern. As we understand the importance of the SVOC pattern in English sentence structure, we'll unlock new levels of fluency and comprehension. So, buckle up and let's get started. The SVOC pattern is a fundamental building block of English sentence structure. It stands for Subject Verb Object Complement. To put it simply, a subject is what the sentence is about. The verb is the action performed by the subject. The object is what receives the action, and the complement describes or provides more information about the object. Here is a basic example. She, subject, painted, verb, the wall, object, blue, complement. Now, you might be wondering, why is understanding the SVOC pattern important? Well, it's all about clarity and understanding. The SVOC pattern allows you to form complex ideas and convey them clearly, preventing misunderstandings. It aids in effective communication, allowing you to describe situations, thoughts, or actions in a more detailed manner. Moreover, recognizing the SVOC pattern will help you improve your reading comprehension skills. It can guide you to identify the relationships between different parts of a sentence, thereby enhancing your understanding of what you read. The beauty of the SVOC pattern is that it's everywhere in English, from casual conversations to formal writings. Look at these examples. 1. I. Subject. Consider. Verb. Him. Object. My best friend. Compliment. 2. They. Subject. Elected. Verb. Her. Object. President compliment. The more you use and recognize the SVOC pattern, the more natural it will feel. Practice makes perfect. That wraps up our discussion on the importance of the SVOC pattern in English sentence structure. Remember, mastering this pattern can significantly improve your communication and comprehension skills in English. So, take the time to understand and practice it. We hope you found this video helpful, and we look forward to helping you continue your journey to English mastery in our future videos. Happy learning, everyone!